Hello everyone. In this video, we are going to solve this question. So, in previous video, we have learned iter rows and iter items. So, this question is related to those functions. So, let us read my question. The question is iterate over a data frame containing names and marks, then calculate grade as per marks. I am having this these rules and I have to iterate over a data frame and I will calculate grade for marks and add them to the grade column. So the rule is if marks is more than 90 then grade will be A plus and marks is between 70 to 90 grade is A and likewise my grade are a plus A, B, C, D and E. So we are going to take this data frame. So this is my data frame. This data frame is having name and marks. In my question, I have to create another column that is grade and that column should contain grades according to these marks. So if, if our marks are 80, then according to my rule the grade should be A between 70 to 90 it is A for marks 80 the grade should be A 95 A plus likewise all the grades should be there so I have created one data frame using dictionary dictionary is having name and marks and list of names and list of marks we need the output we have this data frame so we have to create another column how to create a column in data frame how to add a column you will write df then write our column name then I will add list of grades so first 80 marks should have grade A 95 a plus then 89 again a then 55 what should be the grade for 55 c then for 35 it is e for 61 it is again c 61 it is B now I will print DF so my data frame will now be changed so the output should be like this so this is my question to iterate over the data frame and make the data frame like this so it will have another column grade and that column will have grades according to these marks so let us now try to solve that problem this is my data frame I need output like this so let us try to code and solve that problem so first we will print df so what we will do we will iterate over this data frame so there are two things iterate using iter rows or iter items iter rows or iter items so I have these two functions which function should I use I can solve that problem with both of the functions but the better way to use iter items why because what we will take we will iter iterate over this data frame column by column so first name will come name column then marks column will come so what we will do we will take marks column and try to create a list according to marks this list we will try to create and when we will create this list when this list will be finalized after loop we will assign this list to grade df grade so what will happen a new column will be added so this is my output this output I need this is this output I need so this is not the final thing that I have changed I am having currently data frame df is like this only the grade column is not there 
here I have created this grade column manually and while I am doing code I will create the df co uh, this grade column using iterating over a data frame so what I will do I will iterate over this data frame column by column so what I will do I will iterate for column while I am iterating using iter items it will give me column name then a series of a series that contains all the values of column so it is column and column series in df dot iter items so this will give me column by column data so first it will give me name column and this data this is not useful for me because I need marks for great purpose so I will check here I will process my code only if my column is marks then only I will process the I will proceed to my code so if column is equal to marks it will go to inside my code then what will happen then column series will have a series that will have these marks so again I will iterate over for m in marks in column series so it will have all the marks now I will print m so that you will know what m contains so it should contain 80, 95, 89, 55, 35 and 61 all these marks serial so you can see now I am getting all the marks in a M. So here what I will do, I will try to create a conditional statement. If what are my conditions? These are my conditions. These. These are my conditions. So I will take these conditions and create my code according to this these are my conditions if marks is greater than 90 that means if m is greater than equal to 90 then what I will do I will create a list empty list here and I will append the grade into it if it is more than 90 the grade should be a plus if m is greater than or equal to 70 and m is less than 90 then the grade should be a if the marks is greater than 60 and less than 70 the grade should be b if the marks is greater than 50 and less than 60 the grade should be C if the marks is greater than equal to 40 and less than 50 the grade should be D and at the end If the marks is less than 40 grade should be E so this will create my list what I am doing here I have created an empty list then I am iterating using iter items so it will iterate column by column so first it will take name column then it will take marks column this was my data frame so I am iterating using column by column so, so first it will take name column then marks column so I am ignoring name column because I don't need it 
then I am taking marks column. So if column is equal to marks, then I will take each marks one by one. First, it will check 80. Then when 80 will come, in my code, I am checking. If m is equal to 80, first 80 will come. So it will check if 80 is greater than 90, no, then elif. Elif. All the things will be elif. So if m is greater than 70 years and m is less than 90 years, so it will append a into the list. So likewise for every marks, my list will be appended with grades and at the end I will assign this list to grade column. So this is my simple code for creating a list of grades then assigning it to, into data frame that means a new column grade will be added so let us check it now and i will print df at the end you can see a grade column is added and the grades are added now before that my df was with two columns so you can see here I have done it manually. So the same grades A A plus A C E B A A plus A C E B. This is added using this code. In the previous slide, I was assigning it manually. Now I am using my code to assign the grades using loop. So I am iterating over data frame and assigning it assigning grades to marks and adding that column into my data frame. So this was the question where I am using iter items. If you have any doubt, you can ask me in comments. Thank you.